I made a video yesterday concerning UK riots and it's all about far right versus immigrants and here I want to refute the allegation that uh, immigrants are the ones who make most crimes in a society in the in the West whether in the UK in the US so now let's see what do the studies and findings say about this is it always um, right that immigrants are the ones who make troubles and uh, commit crimes now let's look at this uh, this source from McGill University does immigration really increase crime? Study shows that migrants don't cause crime rates to increase, but false perceptions endure. Here I was responding to one um, of the far-right pro-Zionists who was uh, blaming it always on the immigrants on Twitter slash X. Uh, of course, you can see his name here. This is another study from... Uh, Northwestern University, immigrants are significantly less likely to commit crimes than the U.S. born. This is a U.S. Uh, based uh, study, a recent one from March uh, 2024. Study finds over a 150 year period, immigrants have never been in incarcerated at a greater rate than those born in the United States. Let's check more studies. This is uh, another study by Stanford University, the renowned Stanford Institute for Economic Policy Research. The mythical tie between immigration and crime. Research by Stanford's Ran Abramitsky and co-authors uncovers the most extensive evidence to date that immigrants are less likely to be imprisoned than U.S. born individuals. More studies and more sources. Let's have a look over here. Immigrants are less likely to commit crimes than U.S. born Americans. Studies find. This is uh, another source. Now, you can find a lot of sources. These are just samples of academic studies by renowned, renowned uh, Western universities and uh, academies and uh, news agencies. Uh, of course, there are some other news agencies that will say otherwise. This is uh, simply because every news agency has its agenda. And we all know that um, those who always, if you want to say, instigate uh, riots and uh, clashes uh, are most likely to be linked to Zionism. Tommy Robinson, for example, uh, he has very close ties to Zionism. Kurt Filders in the Netherlands as well. Uh, so they are the ones who stir such uh, unrests and create uh, social discomfort and create problems by spreading rumors about immigrants, about Muslims in the West, and generalizing. Now, just to conclude with this point, in every community you will find the good and the bad and the ugly. You can find a criminal who happens to be white, born in UK, born in US, uh, you know, or you can find at the same time Another criminal who happens to be brown, uh, African-American, or uh, a European from African origins, or a Muslim. In every community, you will find the good and the bad. So, you cannot say that the other group are all bad and make such a stereotype and generalization that will uh, reinforce your prejudice and claim that you are... your your community is angelical. It's all, I mean, uh, innocents and angels who never commit crimes. So this hopefully will put some sense into the minds of those who uh, keep on blaming it on the immigrants 
on the Muslims, on the uh, Europeans of African origins or the immigrants and so on and so forth. And these studies, I think, are sufficient to, uh, you know, debunk all their false claims about uh, immigrants and crime rate. Uh, thank you for watching and listening, and hopefully you will have more beneficial videos about these topics uh, soon. Have a good day or a good night, wherever you are.